mouth breathing can be initiated because of some fundamental causes. The most common ones can be a blocked nasal pathway where the child is not able to breathe through the nose either because there is a pathology or some underlying condition attached to it. The tongue is ideally supposed to be on the level up, higher up in the jaw. But when we are mouth breathing, tongue goes down and as soon as the tongue falls down, the arch starts to constrict and that's what leads to the changes in the dental structures. So mouth breathing can be corrected right from a very young age where children come and see us. When I see a child like, you know, a little toddler walking with the lips open, I immediately address to the parents that you don't have to go in for a therapy. Just check if the child doesn't have any symptoms of flu, cold, cough, anything and advise them constantly and diligently to keep their lips close together. The lip seal is the first stage to establish nasal breathing if there is no underlying cause. So very simple steps, but they can lead to a big change. Thank you.